No, oh, Wolfie didn't get any sleep at all. He spent the whole night eating. <laughs> Wolfie just stayed up all night eating. All right, cool. So, uh, all we gotta do is turn this thing on. And then... We'll get power to, uh, the pump. It's not enough, you know what's funny, it doesn't put out enough power to, to run both the water sift and the pump. So we're just gonna use this pump to just get water in there. And the dupes should be pretty satisfied with this in terms of, uh... Their living scenario, living situation here. Slave driver, uh, no! Sometimes you got the lunchies. <laughs> Sometimes. Let's see, water's filling up. Food shortage again. Look at that. 1,500,000 germs or something crazy. Holy crap. Okay. Overlord might be the overseer. Good. Yeah, get it backed up on that sieve. We'll get one completely full, and we'll get a little bit of a buffer going, like a, some extra water in the, uh, in the dirty water pipes. Oh, that thing's full. Okay, good. It'll take us some time to get it, but let me see. Choose blueprint. Uh, hatchling eggs. They create coal waste. Uh, sh no. Nah. I'll mess these eggs. I ain't farming nothing yet. Carbon dioxide crazy, like crazy all over the place. This is a wood burning machine. We have all this natural gas over here. I suppose we could probably try to use it. We'll get there. We'll get there. That's a later thing. How much is this at? Uh, not full yet. It hasn't even actually... Yeah, wow. They haven't even filled the pipe yet. They're just not taking enough shits. <laughs> What up, X? I think only will ever have a hand pump to move liquids and pipes for electrical pumps. They do have, uh, you, oh yeah, you can't move water in pipes, but yeah, 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 I, I see what you're saying. They can, uh, move water by bottles and move it one bottle at a time, but that's about it. I'm off on a Friday yard doing the news. I know! No, it was just too soon, man. I didn't feel like doing the news. This just wasn't a whole lot. Everything I had was kind of like this bullshit. It was like, I'm just gonna bitch for the sake of bitching. bitching. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, no, no. Well, well, news is gonna be coming back for sure. That show ain't going nowhere. Food shortage. Oh my god. Shush. Shush already with that. We might have to start pulling some of this over. All right. So this is starting to get, uh, starting to get some water. We're getting some Indian food for dinner. Oh, nice. Mr. Oni video. Hey, man, guess what? I'm taking these vibes and I'm chopping them up to put on YouTube. So, we're playing for a few hours. Today, tomorrow, or yesterday, today, uh, and then wherever else, and I'll take all those vods and, uh, and I already chopped up last night's vod, and I'll do the same thing with this one. I'll do it tonight. I'll chop it up. Um, they're like longer episodes than normal. They're not like 30 minutes. They're like 45 minutes to an hour. But, you know, people want it. They wanted that kind of content, so. Give it to the people, man. This is one of my highest requested, consistently highest requested shows to, for people, for me to do, has been Oxygen Not Included Adventures, so. I think it's perfect. The, the added bonus of having chat here just gives me something, some, something else to talk about. Talk shit about. <laughs> All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. One reservoir full. More than Blizz Blues. Oh yeah, people. People. Blizz Blues is. Uh, I think people have kind of just given up on that. Like Blizzard's already a parody of themselves at this point. I'm not sure what Blizzard's gonna, what uh, Darnell gonna add to that. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, plus I think a lot of people don't know I'm Darnell still. So, <laughs> so there's that too. <laughs> All right, the reservoir is getting full. I don't have to wait for it to get too full, I don't think. I just want to have enough for a buffer. But I would like some more, though. 
Or is Darnell you? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Tons of germs. Tons of Pluto water. Got my room. I'll blow my... <laughs> if I didn't say it, try flying. <laughs> <laughs> uh, armored log, armored riding log, whatever. God damn. Uh, yep. Yep. <laughs> okay, I think we could go ahead and turn off this. The pump. We were done pumping in water, fresh water. Uh, and now everything is going to run. I and mean, we could even break that pipe if we wanted to. Like, just cut this pipe and just be done with it. Let me see. Let me go ahead and. Uh, isn't there a way to snip? Let me see, yeah. Disconnect utility networks. Liquid pipe. How does that work? It's a mod, so I don't know how that works. Uh, then we can enable this. And then that will, uh... Look at that. That's it. Two tiles. Oh, two tiles. Oh, okay. So let me, uh... Thank you. Oh, cool. Just does it. Excellent. We should empty the pipe first. <laughs> but no, this is fine. Water goes in. Fresh water goes out. This thing's hardly hardly using any power because it's just it's not being used constantly. Good. Arbicorn. Sure, take that. Oh, oh, wow. Okay. Whoa. Holy shit. Fuck. Okay. So we need to actually start addressing this problem over here with the, uh, uh, <laughs> we need to have some, uh, natural gas processing here to get some real power, which means we need a place to put batteries. I like to put batteries at the top because it's where all the hydrogen likes to pull. So it's kind of a nice place just to stuff them naturally. Um, oh man. We don't even, we're not even using electricity anywhere, man. Is this thing still emitting natural gas? All right, wow, we filled this up. Let me see, what do we have? We have some uh, oxygen, some carbon dioxide, some polluted oxygen, natural gas. So we have, uh, I mean, way more natural gas than anything else. So it's just a tiniest little bit of Pluto oxygen and all that stuff. How about these ones? Pluted oxygen. So there's some, there's still some stuff that doesn't belong in some of these, but we can, um, we can worry about that later. <laughs> now for heat management. I know, huh? Where's my, uh... Oh, obviously, this room, room is going to put out tons of heat. The batteries here are putting out heat, obviously. Um, the rest of the base is pretty cool, but that's not going to last. Yeah, it's not going to last. Let me see. Another future mic. Yeah, I know. I, I'm trying to think of, like, what I should build next. Like, we have so much stuff now. So now it's like, what do we build next to advance this colony. <laughs> hmm. At most suit. You should start a future mic problem list. Time for posting notes. I know, I know, huh? Yeah, let me uh let me actually let me let me get the <laughs> let me let me let me get the post-it notes out. I need a smaller marker. There we go. All right, let me see. Oh, so we need a farm. Yeah, let's get this, this post-it notes time. All right, so we need a farm. Farm. I'll go ahead and uh, actually, you know, we'll make a, a more concise list here. So farm. We need enclosed base. Should we start focusing on that? Well, we don't. Have, oh, you know what? We don't have uh, any kind of airflow. Like, we don't have vents or anything anywhere to push air anywhere. Like, right now we're doing fine, but, I mean, you could see right here, even in this room, there's already a patch of, uh, of, of, uh, natural gas kind of floating around in there. So, we do need to have some kind of, um, uh, air conditioning, I guess. Before it gets too late, maybe. Isn't that what the outro's for? <laughs> well, we're making the list now. <laughs> We're making the list now. Because some of this stuff we're going to have to tackle right away. A farm. Where can we put a farm on this? We did well with this. This part's great. 
You know what? Let me actually, you know, I'm gonna go and just start on, on that farm. I'm not so worried about, like, these, these things are always gonna be there. Both of them are operating right now. So, yeah, we're, we're never gonna, like, have to worry about natural gas as, as, in terms of, like, um, running out of natural gas. Like, that's just gonna be over there. Oh, always there. Uh, this thing is dormant. This thing is spouting right now. We have plenty of water, fresh water. And we have, a uh, the bathroom system is working great. So we don't have to worry about water from that. We could extend that, expand that a little bit if you wanted to. We can go ahead and build another layer of, um, of apartments just to have six. But we'd be pushing down into this space here where we have carbon dioxide issues and heat. I mean, this stuff's gonna build some heat. Oh, you know what? Yeah, let's, uh, let's seal off the bottom floor here. We'll leave room for, like, for gases to move, but I think, um, for now we should put, like, a layer of, uh, of insulated tile, so. Seal. Basement. Also, not to mention the heat. I never watches the outro to remind him of his future problems. <laughs> Some of you guys know me so well. <laughs> Let's see. We'll make an igneous rock. Uh, yeah, it's just fine. Slow heating. Sure. Um, some of these things are tall, so let's go ahead and build it right across here. Hmm. That's annoying. That's really annoying. But I think it has to be done. What can we put up here, though? Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six... Put a walkway and no, let's do this. We're gonna build it down one. And put it all the way out. And we'll do the same thing on this side. Should we do like two layers? What about that CO2? It'll it'll continue to seep down there, and the oxyphrens will will basically eliminate them. Uh, just you know, slowly, <laughs> very slowly, but they will take care of the problem for us. We'll just leave a gap on both sides just to let it let it seep. But right now, we just don't want to just unfettered just like heat exchange. We just don't want heat from the bottom to just move to the top freely. Um, so if we just kind of have a little bit of control, then we should be able to manage it. Uh, with this, we should probably go ahead and actually chop this up so we can actually use this space. So we'll do four. Yeah, that's perfect. Then we can use this space for whatever we need. Now, farm, I would say if we're gonna build a farm, let's build a farm up top somewhere. Look at this, look at all this beautiful space we have. Like, this is a lot. We should go up here and just, like, set aside some of this space. I mean, like, we built all this that we don't need now. Don't need that. Don't need this. Or that, or that, or that. I guess we'll get rid of that, too. <clears throat> Can they reach all that? We'll do that. Hmm. Everything's at fives right now, so... Well, that's not. Oh, good, they're working on it. Let me see, uh, construction... Yeah, you know, we could open this up even more. Because there's, there's a lot of space here, right? So we could put, we could put a couple apartments up there if we wanted to. And then have the farm up here, or over here to the side. Then we can have, like, these four people can be dedicated to working down here or whatever, right? Uh, and then we can have, um, these four people that'll be dedicated to working in the farms or whatever else up here. Like, up here where it's nice. So this is the trenches. Everywhere below the, below the printing pod is the trenches. Everything above the printing pod is, uh, <clears throat> it's all the nice shit. I think that's good. And we have enough water and everything to, to support all that, so it won't be too hard. We can just copy this entire thing. Use a triple floor to run that big thick cable from uh, one side of the base to the other, so it will completely destroy the core. One soft floor tile, place to run the wire, then another. 
Yeah, I, I, I've done that before. I had on the outside of the base is what I did. I had insulated tile, and then I had a ladder, and then I had, like, fat cable. Uh, and that was a good way of keeping things, um, separated. It got really hot in that corridor, though. But yeah, you know, it's a good idea. You're right. I just don't know where the outside of my base is going to be right now. Okay, they're working on it. They're getting there, they're getting there. They did this super quick, man. Um... I'd like to just get in there and chop this up. It's, it's, again, it's, it just takes forever to do it this way, but... Again, it's nice just to have it open. I'll be able to get to that soon. <coughs> Pardon me. Everybody made tunnels for wires and pipes to keep the base on the thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Absolutely. I was thinking this is going to be where I was going to put some pipes and or put some uh, cables. And it still might be. Um, but we'll see. How's the decor in these rooms? It's clean. Uh, oops, that's not the core. Oh yeah, it's still crap. Navy Devil's outfit. <laughs> so total decor is minus. Yeah, this is still bad. It's still bad. How, how is this so good? Wooby's outfit. Wooby. You know what? I do have another. I think I have two more. I thought I had more clothing. Let's see. Snazzy suit. It's inside of the storage bin. All right, we'll, we'll put it on someone else later. <clears throat> Dormant. That's wild how much natural gas we have access to. And now we're just gotta get into the <laughs> mode of trying to control it. Appeased! Welcome back! Thank you so much for that! Much appreciated! 47 months, one more month, four years. Thimble reed seed. Someone earlier was saying they didn't have any thimble reed seeds. <laughs> they get into it, okay. We get to that faster though. We're gonna get some, um, fireman's poles, especially on right here, from the top to the bottom. Yeah, just from the top to the bottom there. Oh, that could be reached because it's not done yet. Almost four. It still feels like the holidays, doesn't it? I mean, it's January 3rd. If you're watching this on YouTube, that was a long time ago. <laughs> but it, it still feels like... It's because, it's because like... I think most people's regular schedule pretty much goes back on track next Monday, right? I mean, nobody here has worked a full week, I don't think. I hope you guys didn't work a full week. New Year's was this week. Um, so yeah, like, regular week starts next week. Yeah, exactly, yeah, so we're still on vacation till next Monday, yeah. Same. <laughs> this isn't a real stream, this is, we're just hanging out. <laughs> real stream start, starts next week. <laughs> now you're sick? Yeah, no, I, I, I feel that. I haven't worked a full week in my life, oh, era. It's because you can't hold a job. <laughs> That's the problem, man. <laughs> Probably because school was out. It's exhausting having a nine-month-old for two freaking weeks. Yeah. Oh, man. But isn't it exciting, though? It's exhausting and... And exciting. Now I worked a full week in three years. Yeah, my schedule's all messed up. More with my newly found insomnia. Can't wait for a normal routine. 
You know, I, I, I've been having issues going to sleep um, ever since I've <clears throat> bounced back from being sick. It's because, like, I was taking Sudafed, like, 12-hour Sudafed, so it was keeping me up late. Um, and I wasn't smoking or anything, so it was like, I was basically detoxing on all fronts and just taking antibiotics and just taking, you know, whatever. I wasn't doing caffeine or anything like that. Um, so yeah, I, 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 I was having issues like going to sleep. My schedule was all fucked up, so I was sleeping in. And so I'm, I can't wait to get back on a normal schedule. Like, I love the holidays. I love Christmas. I think it's awesome. But man, uh, please, <laughs> like I need, I need, I need a regular schedule, a regular life. I think I can reach all these just fine. Good. A lot of weed, uh, Zepalcolone and maxing out on Trazodone now. Nothing helps. Can't wait to hear from my sleep study. Oh, you took a sleep study. Oh, good. So you're, you're doing like actual... You're getting like actual uh, uh, testing done. That's good. Yeah, I can't reach for a guy. Getting there. Little bits of water down here. What if I should drip some water in here just to top it off? <laughs> we'll do that later. Right now, right now we have we have so much stuff to do. Your first six socket. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I was gonna play some Poe, but I uh, how 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 many how how far into the new season is everybody right now? Like, what is it? Like a a month? A month and a half? I feel like jumping in right now. I should just wait till the next season, right? can't reach that unless I cut it. Almost a month, yeah. <clears throat> oh, new season ain't coming for a bit? Oh. Yeah, I have my, what is she like, level 49, my witchy, witchy feet, I think's her name. But I think, I think I'm doing, I don't know where I'm at with that. I just kinda like casually play, you know, I don't play, you know, just casually, just like whatever. Get in, play, and then forget how to play, and then get in, play, and then forget how to play. <laughs> That's pretty much been my, my mode of apparandi, <laughs> for the most part. Casually watch the witch, oh, that's, maybe that's the that I should play next week. I'm gonna watch the show and then play like everybody else. Although, I understand, like, the excitement of getting into playing a game that you're just watching on TV. But Doom didn't do that for me, though. <laughs> Doom was the one game I was like, oh, god, I'm never gonna play this game again. The movie. Wow, this area is cool. Look at this. Packed. Just packed. Wild. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. We have lots of food. Our food supply is fantastic. We're still not really using much in terms of power, but man, look at how open everything is. So we can really, like, I'm, I'm gonna open this up on this side too. Um, but it's looking like we can probably start to do some serious expansion here. This is all just prep. Je wow! Uh, yeah, this is all just prep. Let me see. Boop, boop, boop. We get all these resources from strip mining everything, and then, um... And then we start to actually fill in the gaps. This is a great way to build, though, man. Just open everything up, and then you start building. Except for this down here. We have to keep this sealed off. <laughs> this down here needs to stay sealed off. Which is a great show as long as you realize The Witcher is more a political thing than an action story. And ass to mouth, they setting up the world a lot. Oh, okay, cool. Cool, cool. Neither these these uh my oxyphones are not uh they're not they're not working as uh as, as hard as I would like. <laughs> Alestis, it's 
it's, it's, at, it's at the moment, but yes, the first thing that comes to mind is not at the moment for some reason. I don't know why. Just popped in there. Just popped in there. God damn it. This is a stupid thing. Let's just break this thing down. We don't need it. Look at this. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. And it's very breathable. Like we're not we're, we're not suffering from a loss of uh, of any kind of uh, of oxygen anywhere. Like we're not short on oxygen. We have plenty. We could probably go ahead and kill these, uh, kill this wash, well, at least these two outhouses, because I don't think they're using these at all. They can just use the ones inside the houses. Well, they can just borrow somebody else's. <laughs> we'll deconstruct those. Get rid of them. We'll leave the wa the washing station, though, because I don't know what's over here, man. Oh, why do they do that? Oh, I hate that so much. Oh, uh, I messed that up, didn't I? Damn it. Their stress is fine. We've got tons of food. Like, this is great. We're just cruising right now, dudes. Just cruising. We're just going to open all this stuff up. We're going to take all these resources and pocket it. And then we're going to turn around and use them somewhere else. Oh, whoops. Can't do that yet. Yeah. Uh, and Cogna, you said you do like this too? Strip mining uh, build is what you normally do. Do you do, you do it like this where you open up your base like considerably and then and then start to kind of build from there Ooh, look at all that heat though yeah so we're not going to cut into this abyssal light here we're going to leave this abyssal light intact because it's basically keeping us from uh burning up and actually you know we should probably put a better door here as well um just to keep this area because this area is going to be hot no matter what yeah Oh, whoops. Just keep all these, keep these, just basically keep juggling these things. A pip squeak. Ah, uh, we just killed a bunch. What's inside the gas tanks? Let's go take one. Uh, 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 lots of natural gas. And some other gases too, it's not, it's not pure. But we have two gas vents that are like right on top of each other. <laughs> and I have to laugh because it's like, it's such a streamer advantage thing somehow. Uh, but, but yeah, so we have plenty. Plenty of gas, yeah. Yeah, Notorious, it's nice. Uh, wait, 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 hold on a second though. You ain't seen nothing yet. Uh, right over here we have a we have a cool steam vent, and right below that we have another cool steam vent. So we're like just actually swimming in uh, <laughs> in liquids and gas. So we're good. We're totally good. We haven't found anything else though. No oil or anything like that. So so I don't know if uh, if I'm gonna continue to be lucky. There might not be any oil anywhere. Finally. Finally, it's done. As soon as they're done with these two. Two books. One, two. Good. Perfect! And then we get, uh... Can we get to chop it over here? I wonder... Can they reach that from here? Hmm. Never do that. Dig down as we usually find oil. I found it actually on my last save, it was actually above the base, like near the top. Careful, heat killed me on cycle 311. No plants growing out and no food, and out of food. Yeah, I've been living on mush bars this whole time. This whole time. So, uh, so yeah, no, no, we're, we're, we're gonna eventually, the, the reason why I'm clearing all this stuff out is because I'm going to probably, uh, tomorrow or later or something, um, I'm going to go through and put 
some farms in. That way we can, uh, that way we can, you know, better manage our food and get better food and everything. Hey, fools, it's going great. We are, uh, we're pretty much wrapping up right now, just cleaning everything up, and then, you know, you're gonna run out of dirt soon. I don't, I don't know if I'm running out of dirt. I feel like I have, like, a lot. Uh, what is that? Cultivable soil, dirt. I have 416 tons. More than anything else, I have dirt. Oh, actually, wait, raw mineral. Uh, yep, nope, more than anything else. I have tons of dirt. Right, hurry, hurry up and wake up. It's never enough. I know, it's true, it's never enough. Hurry up and go, hurry, hurry, clean this up. I want to get all this stuff cleaned out, too. And I think they can reach the rest. Yeah, they can reach the rest, so... Gives us access. I mean, there's a ton of seeds, too, that we've cleared out as well. You playing I jinxed it? You think I'm gonna go through all now? Shouldn't have said anything. Yeah, so like I said, we'll we're gonna leave the Abyssalite intact. We're not gonna mess with the Abyssalite. Everything else can go. Oops, well we got to mess with some of it then. Because I can't reach that. <laughs> The pip can, though. Beautiful. Beautiful. You got a wood generator? Yeah, that's like my only wood burner. Is basically just running this. These batteries get full, and then they sit here for like probably 20 cycles, and then just slowly trickle out for the water sieve. Um, we're a very low-tech colony right now. We have all the research done. Not all, but we have a lot of the research done. Uh, but for the most part, we're pretty low tech. We have like a you know, we have a bike to, to run this battery, to run this pump, for example. But these things are full, so we don't need them anymore. So everything's localized, and I really kind of like that setup. And I might actually, when we when we when we start to build actual like you know full base worth of uh, of electrical work, uh, I'll probably try to keep that in mind and try to keep that same type of thing going. You know, just keep just try to keep the uh, <clears throat> keep things localized. 